hey guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video we're gonna be reviewing and having first impressions of the jawbreaker palette the only reason why i'm holding my phone is because the lighting is good it makes my teeth look yellow oh my god I gotta close that yes you heard that right when he finally got some coin to afford a good ass palette but you know that's too good to be true so after pay is helping your girl Afterpay, I would be a good sponsorship for y'all because honestly, I'm a broke girl. I'm not, I'm not really, but I'm trying to save and I get paid weekly. So I'm trying to make those bi-weekly payments, you know? And of course, this video is going to be a voiceover because I don't have anything to hold my phone to get this good lighting that's coming in because I ordered some equipment from Wish and that should be coming soon. But hopefully you guys don't mind the voiceover. Hopefully you guys are okay with that recently. And if you would like to continue watching how I did this look, how the color swatches, then keep on watching. I just got a shower, but I don't care. I like, I like to make videos and I like to be clean. So look what I got. <laughs> oh my god look it's the jawbreaker palette so this is the box it comes in it was nice and heavy but look it's vegan cruelty free and it's amazing so in general i was like pretty surprised in how heavy it is but then again it contains multiple shades i believe like 20 or 24 yeah 24 but look at all those shades look at that pigment i can't wait to play with it but oh my god it's so beautiful i'm gonna be quiet for a bit I'm so freaking happy that this has a mirror on it so this is the first row of the shades and i could tell it's like a warm palette or warm row flat out the second row reminds me of easter and to me the third row it just it was just a rainbow and the last row could go like a night look on a date soft glam i really did enjoy swatching these look how beautiful it is honestly it is jeffrey's version of a rainbow the jawbreaker palette and i just enjoy looking at the full swatches in my arms look how beautiful that is so for the eyes we're going to start with the elf camo concealer and we're going to use a real techniques sponge to blend that out and make it look and white and pretty for a base and then we're gonna use the shade virgin and do that or blend that in in our brow bone and then the next shade i am going to use bubble gum for the inner crease and just blend that out with a fluffy blending brush from morphe and you're just gonna use a back and Fourth motion until you get the pigment that you like and with the same blending brush we're gonna use a shade gumdrop which is a beautiful lilac by the way and we're gonna use that in our outer corner and blend it out till we get to the color of it that we want it to and now with a mini breaker we're gonna use purple punch and do that in the crease so we can make gumdrop pop even more it ain't a tutorial for me unless we're doing a cut crease. So with a flat brush, we're going to use that same concealer and we're going to create a cut crease until it looks like a wing. Now with a flat angle brush, we're going to use the shade Brain Freeze and we're going to put that in the inner corner of the eyelid until it looks really good. <laughs> And now with a smaller flat brush, we're going to take the shade gumdrop and put it in the middle so I can create like a color blend with the next shade, which is bubblegum and brain freeze. So now with bubblegum, we're going to take like another flat brush and we're going to end the wing with that and we're going to blend it out with gumdrop so I can create a bl perfect blend. Next is going to be the next white eyeliner and sorry if i couldn't do it on the camera but you know your girl gotta focus or not i don't want the wing to come out crooked same here with the eyeliner just an elf jet black eyeliner and honestly i think bubblegum would make a really pretty blush color so i decided to mess with that and i put it on my nose 
Now I'm doing the same steps underneath my eye and I'm gonna put brain freeze first in the inner corner and then bubble gum in the last and then I'm gonna put that on my nose. Yeah, and then I'm gonna put ah brain drop <laughs> in the middle. I forgot the name of it. And that's the look. And now I'm gonna use some mascara from the Thrive Cosmetics, put it underneath my eyebrows. And I'm gonna put a gem that you just get from Walmart for 99 cents and you stick it in the middle. And then I'm gonna use the eyeliner, put it at, ah. Okay, so now with an eyeliner pencil brush, you're gonna use the Wet n Wild Paint Pot in White and you're gonna create a circle so we can create that candy emoji. And as you can see, you can see me from many angles. Ooh. Now I'm gonna take the shade Q and that didn't even get filmed. So I'm being a YouTuber now. And now with this blue shade, <gasps> Oh my god, we're gonna make it look more shading and the candy and then we're gonna use bubble gum on the top and then we're gonna use the eyeliner to create like the ruffles of the wrapper. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> I edited it first and now I'm just doing a voiceover. Pinches mocos. Okay, so now I'm gonna use a wet and wild paint pot paint palette and all these in the primary shades basically so i'm gonna mix the green and the yellow to create like a lime green and even though i put that in the middle and you couldn't see it i put it in the ruffles and now i'm using the white eyeliner to create its shape add more definition and now i'm using the shade hot fudge from the mini breaker to create shadows so it can look realistic and now <laughs> I'm gonna use the black eyeliner to outline the shapes so it can like do that oomph, like that pop out stuff. And I'm just gonna add some details so it can look all nice and true. And with the eyeliner, I'm gonna draw a line across and add more oof. And now with that white eyeliner, I'm gonna add sparkles and lights so it can look all nice. And now with these lashes, uh, we're gonna laugh about me putting on. And now with the Jeffree Star with more C color operation, I'm gonna use the shade Mannequin and put that in the middle of my lips. And then I'm gonna use the shade Leo. And I'm gonna put it on the sides until it looks good. And it does. And that's the finished look. I look like a cute pastel looking ass bitch. I hope you guys don't mind my ratchet ads just holding my phone and talking like hello guys so welcome back to my channel and then to yeah sorry <laughs> and thanks for watching thanks for supporting my channel i wouldn't expect to get to like 129 ACB 130 subscribers but i don't know who's that one subscriber that let go but i hope i don't I hope I can like reach enough to pursue my dream of doing something that's not being a teacher or like retail job. I want to have like a career that I can pursue my talents like my drawing, my painting, my beauty skills. Mm -hmm. or... So I'm hoping one day only a girl can dream from brown so you know. <laughs> but and if you guys like this video please don't forget to like, subscribe, and bring the notifications if somehow you like my videos and you want to be alerted to see more of them. But anyways, thanks for watching the video and have a good one.